Okay, okay. Who got their cups? Who got their cups, girl? Who got their cups, girl? Y'all like the intro song, girl? Y'all like it? Y'all love it? Oh, I love it, girl. It gives me everything I need. What's going on? What's tea, sisters? Oh, yes, the introductions, girl. Is y'all thirsty, girl? Are y'all thirsty, sisters? Are y'all motherfucking thirsty, girl? I am so thirsty. Yeah, that's a little intro, girl. Girl, I'm always feeling it, girl. I'm late. Girl, read a girl one thing, you know, one thing, <laughs> child, I sip tea on color people's time. When I say 7 o'clock, y'all just look for 705, 708, or something like that, girl. So listen, girl, is y'all here for it, girl? Is y'all here for it, sister? Is you here for it? I just want to know if y'all here for it. Whew, this is prime time tea. I might start doing it on a messy Monday. Prime time tea, girl. Whew, it's, girl, the cup runneth. Over girl, you said she said she dehydrated girl. I got my tea and I got it ready girl. So, yes, Lord, we are here for it. So, it's nothing without further ado. Let's just get right into it, girl. Get right into it. Get into this good old tea. So, today's tea is in regards to a receipt that I got. On New Orleans' own legendary, one and only, Super Saint. So everybody knows her as Super Saint, the the Maven of New Orleans, the one who has brought light and shine and glitter and everything and all kind of colors to the great city of New Orleans. Let us back up for just a moment. As y'all know, I will not know who she is because she came into prominence while I was in prison. But as I got out, I found out exactly who she was. But, and while I'll be, and let me say something else. Why, let me just interject something today. I did, which was funny to me. I received a death threat today. So just be all look like, what the fuck? I'm so scared of death threats. I'm scared to die, which I did 10 years in prison. Death is not. So I received a death threat today. But that's something on another note, girl. I'm not worried about nothing or nobody or no thing, girl. It's nobody gonna fuck with me. Nobody's gonna play with me. And I just feel for the bitch to do. I promise you, I'm really protected. So for the girls that gave the little death threat, girl, that's on your body. Let's go. Okay, whatever you were, whenever you were this sister, you can go on my page and conveniently see where I'm booked at any day, every day, all day, every day, all that. So that's, with that being said, cause see, I was, and then it was a little debate in me on whether I should actually do this because it's not even that damaging in my opinion. But, you know, girls, hey, it is what it is. So, that's not my first death threat. I've had death threats before, but this one was just happened today, magically. Oh, girl, whatever. <laughs> I'm, sh I'm shaky. I wouldn't give a fuck. Fuck it. So, let's get into this team. So, okay, okay. Let me give y'all a little bit of the backstory about how I was first introduced to her on media. Now, I have said repeatedly before, I have never in person met her. I've seen her somewhere before, and that was about it. Um, as far as sitting down in her company or anything like that, I have never done. So, I'm gonna just so y'all know that, whatever, whatever. Also, I did make my page private. This is another thing I want to say. I did make my page private because I didn't want people that was not usually coming in here to come in here. I didn't want the lurkers. I didn't want all this stuff. That I wanted to have average numbers like I would normally have when I drop a little T. I never want I don't want this because I'm not doing this for numbers. I'm not doing this for clout, as they say, even though I'm an entertainer. So naturally, all entertainers, in a sense, chase clout. What I want to do, though, I will tell you 
why I am dropping this tea uh, after I drop it. I will tell you why I drop it and show you proof about... No, no, no. Let's do this backwards. Let's do this chronological order. Let me build up to what was said. I'm going to just tell y'all everything that happened in the order in which it happened. So that way it makes more sense. And you know, in my tutu cheeky voice, let's make it make sense. So let's make it make sense. So this is what happened. Okay. So initially, um, I found out about her through the, the media and whatnot and just doing the research and stuff like that uh around the time of my birthday is when the million products sold and it was big news the million products in a month this was big news um around that time also i was doing the this was the beginning of my whole t at three and branding and all this other stuff like that this is all come around around the same time as far as what it was and so i don't know exactly how but the first time i ever noticed her in any live that I was a part of, I was live with Uptown. I was live with Uptown. A lot of stuff was going on between Buck, Uptown, and Trelly. Um, and, and this is a story that I heavily covered and heavily got in into it. So, you didn't miss that. I'm telling, I'm giving, I'm giving y'all the. You did not miss tier three. It's T. It's prime time T. So what happened? So that was part of the backstory. Um, that's the first time I noticed her in any live or anything that had anything to do with shaking or anything that had shaking hands on it. Everybody kind of know that her and Buck had her, their eyes. So I'm, I'm assuming that that's the reason why she was paying attention to it. Because at the time, I was very much so... Uh, I was kind of just in the middle of it, but not really in it. So um, she began following me uh, at that point in time. She... Uh, um, and I I shouted her out and on one of my live on day. I said, like, thank you for joining my live. I appreciate you. Uh you know, uh, this is what it is. Thank you. I appreciate you. And it's much love, you know, or whatever, whatever. This is the message I sent her. She uh, replied back in a, in a nice, cool, copacetic way. This is what happened. So this is the this is where it went left, in a sense. Or this is where it began to go left. So if somebody's requesting to go live, I can't receive you this. That's not the time. We'll go live later. So this is what happened. There was a burn page that came in one of my big it was a big live something was going on and i want to say it was with twin maybe it was something going on at the time there was like something that was ultra heavy so it was one of those days that we had like a lot of people in there and i'm not talking about a lot of the newspapers i'm talking about like to me at the time a lot of people was like a hundred people on the current reviews so it was a lot of people at that time for me and what was going on but it was something that was heavily going on at the time and so then what happened was this uh they had a burn page the burn page came on the live and said that it was it was a it was a page with a, it had an avid so i don't know if it constitutes a burn page but the burn page said that hey we are hey i'm i was pregnant for lou I did, I've been fucking Lou, I was pregnant for Lou, and stuff like that. Lou paid me to get rid of the baby and all this other stuff like that. This was the burn page said, in the midst of all them people. Now, some type of way, I'm not sure if she was in the live that day or something, but the burn page was attacking her in that way. So where I end up, I was like, well, listen, what, what's your receipts? I'm asking the burn page, just like, what's your receipts? Would you, would you have any type of proof of this or what you, what you talk about? And so the burn page, kind of just left out now i'm a person of rubber seats you won't come up here i'm not tripping you can say what you want i'm not tripping if it's opinionated but if you come in here and you start spinning spitting facts if you come here and start spitting facts like that you need to have your receipts you need to have your receipts that's what we build this platform on that's what we think about a lot of people don't worry about the truth but here we do here is the truth so what happened was after that So, the burn page actually left after I was like asking the burn page for the receipts. So, the first receipt that I'm going to bring up to you is this. Either somebody screenshot it and send it to her, or she might have been in there herself. I cannot remember exactly which one it was. That's not really important, but she posted on her page at the same time. I don't know what you're talking about. I would never pay for Lou, have no abortion. Lou got his own money. 
I'm a, I'm a boss bitch, yada, 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 et cetera, et cetera. So it, because it happened on my live, I was like, well, let me clear that up. And so I went to her and told her, like I went to her on Instagram and I told her, this is what I told her. She said, that's super sad. And she said, I said, just this February 6th, just a little clarity. I stated repeatedly that there was no proof of that. And I asked my followers to not believe anything that they did not have a receipt of. I saved the live as I assure you, you were not the topic of discussion. Because we weren't talking about, we were talking about twin. That Bird just came in and said that and has since been blocked. And she put, I appreciate you, I really do. Okay. So this is, that's basically what happened. So it's like whatever, whatever. Now, this is the part that I started sipping. Cause I'm shaking. Cause I'm, I'm shaking. <laughs> and so what I did was I went to the burn page myself and I texted the burn page from Instagram and I asked them, what's tea? What's, what's your tea, girl? Who you is? What happened? What's going on? What the fuck? Now, keep in mind, at the time, I didn't know too much about what was going on or didn't care what was going on. So the burn page and I talked on the phone. And the burn page told me a story of wild proportions. Now, this is the thing that part that I don't have a receipt for, but I have the receipt of the next part. So the burn page gave me a whole history, a whole all kind of shit. This, that going on. They've been doing this. They've been doing that. Okay. So what receipts do you have for that burn page? And so I'm like, they was like, oh, I got my receipts. 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 And so the burn page then said, so the burn page then told me, I tell you what. Come meet me and I will show you whatever, whatever. Bear in mind, this is a few weeks after whatever, whatever. The burn page was not coming on the burn page itself. Apparently it had a real page. So listen, while I was at the burn page, while I, I, so I'm referring to them as a burn page, but I know the girl's name. I'm not gonna reveal the girl's name because even so she actually called me today. Excuse me. She called me today, but she talked to me, oh, she talked about this. But she talked to me about this, um, a couple weeks ago. Now this is this has happened. This is literally happening last year. I've been holding these receipts because I had no reason. I had no reason to drop them. So, but now I have a reason, and I'm gonna get to that now. So, fast forward a little bit. So, I went to the burn page, and the burn page actually showed me a document that is signed and stamped by a registered notary lawyer that's in. Um, Jefferson Parish that's in uh, Jefferson Parish that shows where she had to sign a, a way saying that she won't say nothing she don't talk nothing it's not admitting to nothing but it's also saying that she was supposed to be paid $10,000 the people that signed it was Lou and the girl so and it's also signed and stamped by and attorney so I'm gonna get into that because I have the I have the so I recorded it when the girl was explaining to me what was going on but I also took pictures of the document as I was there so yeah we finna get into it now see this is the next part of what happened so I got those things I have those things. So let's get into that right quick. Before, why is she talking? And she's talking. Okay, I'm see why she said. She said she's talking because this is what happened. It was supposed to be $10,000. She said they were supposed to split it up into four payments. Now, the document does say that. But they pay, she got paid the first payment. But she didn't get paid the second payment. And I don't know what happened with the third and fourth payment. Because as I'm talking to her, today... She don't want to talk about it no more. Because I asked her, I would say, I would love to have you on live. Even if you got to black out your face and just tell your story. But she didn't want to do that. 
I can't make you do that. Why is your loss? Why is your loss? How is your loss? Who lost? How is your loss? How is your loss? There is nothing else to be lost about. This is so simple. So, <laughs> why you can what, what y'all can prove? So listen, it's, it's, this is so simple. The burn page came since she was pregnant. I contacted the burn page. The burn page said, I, I'm asking, well, look, you could say anything, but where's your receipt? And so she provided a receipt. So I don't know if so she's scared or what, but let's get into, if let's get into, let them be lost because I'm not, keep going shaking because it's not hard to be, it's not hard to be, it's not hard to catch up. This is very simple what's happening. So this is what the girl is alleging. She's alleging that this was happening. So I asked the girl, what's going on? I actually met the girl and I actually know who the girl is. She did ask me to not divulge her name at this time. Um, I don't know if she'll ever divulge her name. And I asked her, I begged her. I even said, well, girl, I mean, what is it that you, are you afraid of something? She said she's not afraid. I don't know. She must've got paid. I don't know what that key was, but I mean, she does know what I'm going to do today. So we're going to get into no, she did not have the baby. So let's get into the let's get into the documents. So the first thing I want to show is uh, okay, for real. Go right the front. Hold on, y'all. Give me a second. Girl, why is this not going? So much fucking stuff on this fucking phone, girl. Hold on, I should have had this up. Give me a second. There you go. Girl, it might be on this phone. Fuck. Hmm. That bitch on that phone. It's on this phone. It's not on this phone. So listen, y'all got receipts. Let me show y'all. Okay, this is what we're gonna do. This is how we're gonna do this. We're gonna make it so simple. I'm gonna show y'all the documents. Then I'll have to switch phones to show y'all the video because the video is on that phone that I'm gonna talk to y'all now. I thought I had put it on my drive, but I guess it's not on the drive. Um, on my cloud drive, my iCloud, my say, um, my storage drive. Um, all right, so let's get into this. Let's get into the actual documents. Now, I had to just blot out the girl name. So this, and let's get into it. We're gonna get all the way into it. All right. So as you can see, so this is me holding the document which is a confidentiality and non-disclosure agreement. I did block out the girl's name, but as you can see, it contains his name. I can't pronounce his last name, but Louis A, whatever his name is. And that's some address in Terrytown. The girl address, his number name block out. And so, so listen, this is the part that was crazy. It's, it talks about like definition of confidential information for the purposes of the agreement, blah, 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 et cetera, et cetera. But this is the part. It says the disclosing party makes no admission of any relationship professional sexual or personal that is established with the receiving party that's her the girl the receiving party is known or unknown by the disclosing party some shit the disclosing party makes no admission of any relations at any point that could have ever resulted in any child being born to the receiving party so listen <laughs> so okay that's not all calm down take your time so the document is basically saying that there is no admission of nothing I'm not admitting shit. This ain't my baby. Like, I'm not saying this. I'm not admitting nothing. But you are the one party. This is the other party. Now, this is the next part. It's, it's another page that talks about obligations of the receiving party, which basically says that you can't talk about it. You can't benefit, publish, copy, disclose to others, permit the use of others for the benefit or the detriment of the closing party. Basically, this part here, says you can't say nothing to nobody especially for benefits or nothing or nothing 
like that. Like, bitch, you better shut up. The time period, basically forever. <laughs> so, um, this, so that's the, that's the second page, which talks about this. <sighs> oh, yes. Next. They got another point. Oh, it gets better, sister. Oh, it gets better, sister. So, all right. So, next part. This agreement, each part of the obligation should be binding on the representatives assigned the success of such party. Each party has signed this agreement through its authorized representative, blah, 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 compensation. The disclosure party agrees to pay the receiving party the sum of $10,000 USD to enter the agreement and its adherence. The receiving party agrees to accept the sum of compensation for entering into the agreement and adherence to the tenets of every article of the agreement. Further, the sum shall be paid according to the payment cycle, $25,000 upon, or excuse me, $2,500 upon signing and three subsequent payments, $25,000 USD each one, June 1st, September 1st, December 1st. Below the board parties agree that no insurance shall be paid at any point in any outstanding balance. It was signed by him March 1st, Louis, whatever his name is, that's the commissioner, that's her stamp, and she's, I did look her up too, and it, like, if y'all could see it, that was her, but I blocked her name out. So, listen, that's the, not commissioner, whatever that is, notary, notary, notary public, state of Louisiana, Jefferson Parish. There's a part, it's, it's like, so I did touch, I did hold it, and it have the, um, when it did, it have the, uh, it was, it was stamped. And I'm going to play the video when I come back on my, I'm going to end in a minute and I'm going to come back. But it's stamped like it have a stamp, like a, you know how they do the code. So it had that as well. So I'm like, oh child. Now the agreement doesn't, it specifically says in the agreement that he not admitting to nothing. Like that's like, he not saying, oh, this is my baby. I had a baby. I did this. I did that. The agreement is basically saying that he not admitting nothing, but you can't say nothing either. And this is what you're going to get paid. So if you didn't, this is what I'm weird about. If you didn't have, if that's not your baby, you know that ain't your baby. You wasn't fucking around with her. You never had a relationship with her. You're not admitting that. Why is you giving this girl money? All right. So this is the second part of that. The third part of that is I learned all of this way back in March. March, April, whatever the month is. I learned about this way back then. Now me, I would never say nothing, girl. I would have never said nothing, girl. But this is why... All this came about. Now, I never had no issue with this girl. I never had no problem with this girl. I had never had no beef with this girl. I had. A, I was a fan of this girl. Y'all can see. I just showed y'all the receipt of where I was like, girl, I, you know, this girl not saying that she don't have her receipts. She not talking about nothing. So she not, hey, what's up, everybody? So she not talking about nothing. I never had nothing against this girl. But as y'all know, this is what happened. So, she unfollowed me. Good. Okay. Ooh, I ain't crying. I use the little app that tell you who follow you, who don't. She unfollow me. All right, no problem. I unfollow her. No petite. No shade. Whatever the reason. I never said nothing about you. But I got a message that was saying from a clandestine informant that happened to know them people. And I was like, well, you know, just run it. See if you can run across that desk. Because she know who I am. But, I mean, you know, I ain't did, I ain't really did, a, did a nothing. So for her to be like, oh, I'm going to unfollow Shaky. Like, what the fuck? Like, I never said nothing about her. Let me see. 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 Uh oh, girl. Tell me that's not in this phone too. That's not in this phone. But this is. So, <laughs> girl, it's get, it get cute. Don't trip. Stay right there. So, in the case of the thing, somebody ran across my desk and said that, oh, well, shaking. She think you behind the all T all shade page, which is the page in the, the page that got everybody on it, me included, dragging for everybody, me, Buck, her, everybody in New Orleans. Everybody in New Orleans get dragged on the page. Everybody. Shane, everybody. Everybody get dragged on the page. So she think, somebody said that she said, or somebody told her that it was me. Okay. So this is the next part of this. I was like, well, this girl can't have nothing ill to say about me. But then I found a receipt, and then another receipt came across my desk. It's, I'm not finished. I'm not finished. I'm not finished. So this is a message between her 
and one of my clandestine informers. As y'all remember, the girl from Houston, Jay's the model, was getting into it a lot with our good sister Dina Marie. They was getting into it. You heard me? They was getting into it a lot on the, on my page. And so Dina Marie was and her out. No lie. Dina Marie was and her out. And so, um, so Dina Marie, now this is somebody I never said this before. So Dina Marie was and her out. But the girls, the girl Jazza kept saying, bitch, that's why you was having threesomes with Super and Lou. That's why you was sleeping on her sofa. That's whatever, whatever. So Dina Marie's telling Super, like, girl, come and clear this up for me. So this was Super's response. You remember that too? So Super tells her, I don't think you understand, son. I said plenty of times and Lou that you ain't never steal nothing out of my house. Live with me or no gay shit. You the one, you the only one still entertaining. You know shake a messy punk and you chilling on live with him like mess won't start. Excuse me, sister. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> what? 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 Excuse me, sister. Them girls was beefing way before I even had an Instagram account. <laughs> way before I ever had an Instagram account. My them girls been hating each other way before I had an Instagram account. So at the same time, let me take a little sip, girl. Hold on. We only bringing you up, Dina. Nobody said nothing bad about you before you go ahead, girl. Go ahead, girl. We ain't saying nobody said nothing bad about you. I'm just bringing up what was said about me. All I said was, "Well, shake is a messy punk. This, that, and the other. What?" Girl, well, I never said nothing bad about you in my life. Maybe I should have been saying a few bad things about you. Because, you know, I don't give a fuck. I don't wear makeup. So, at the same, at the end of the day, <laughs> that means nothing. I don't wear it, buy it, whatever the case may be. I will just sit here and, I sit, and I'm going to do what I do like this. I just sip the tea. If them girls want to fight each other, that's on them. If I'm going to give them a plot, I let both of them say what they want to say. Girl, so for you to even be saying... Something about shake. You could have just said, "Well, look, I don't do all the mess." Why you had to type them six letters, them S H A K I E, preceded by messy punk? Well, I understand one thing. Since I am a messy punk, let's show you what a messy punk do. <laughs> and this is what a messy punk do. <laughs> I be messy. So then you get it. I don't care who you is and what you did, but now since I'm a messy punk, I'm going to be a messy punk. You want to call me a messy punk? And see, this is the thing. I wasn't even never being messed up. This stuff has been across my desk for so long. I never used it. I just had it in my desk. I had to go to iCloud to find some of this stuff. I had to subscribe to screenshots and stuff. I had to find, I had to really go into my, I, I like I had to go up and see where the fuck I put this shit. And I, the video and stuff, that's on this phone. It was on the other, I, I didn't even know what phone I was using. So I had to go to iCloud or Google Cloud. I had to really go and dig for it. Because that's how long it's been on my desk. But let me show you something. Let me show you something. Let me just show y'all something. Let me show y'all something. So don't trip. I'm always going to have my receipts, baby. So this is the thing I'm looking at. I'm like, what well, sister? This is starting to make a little bit more sense because of how this all happened. So, there is some tea going on about Judy as well. As y'all know, whatever, whatever. The girl Dion out of, off of L Block wrote a book and there's some stuff in there about Judy. So then all of a sudden, my good sister Dean Bell my good sister Dean Bell, she have she was talking about the parts in the book that have something to do with Judy. Dean Bell page gets zapped. 
Now, if y'all know Dean Bell's my good sister, I don't care if she's right or wrong. I'ma always take her side. It doesn't even matter. Good, that's my good sister. So I wouldn't even give a fuck what they think. I'm gonna take Dean Bell's side. I've been knowing Dean Bell well over 20, 25 years, and me and him never even had a fuss. We had one disagreement one time, and we didn't even fuss. All we did was to stop talking to each other for like three days. That's the only thing me and him ever had. We never had an argument. We never raised our voice to each other. This is somebody I can say I love being Bell like a sister. That's my good sister. And so I'ma take her side. Why is these why is your page just being deleted as soon as you talk, start talking about something that came across your desk? That's what you do, you channel 69 news. So what I did then was say, okay, D Bell, don't worry, I got you. You can you I I'm a let me look into it, whatever, whatever. And I said, Well, I got some tea anyway, because I don't think them girls like me in it either. Because of all the tea I have. And so then she was like, next thing you know, magically this week, me and Dean Bell talk about this on a Sunday. Me and Dean Bell talk about this on a Sunday. Who said get to the point? Goodbye. This, listen, don't tell me about getting to no perk. This is how I like to do my tea. This is how I like to do my tea. I like to tell the whole story, the whole story, the whole thing. Don't tell me get to no perk. Listen. I got to get you up out of here. Don't tell me get to no perm. Don't tell me get to no perm. I'm going to let you stay in this time, but don't tell me, don't tell me get to no perm. I tell a whole story. I tell a whole story. I tell a story from the beginning. I don't want you to miss nothing. I want you to know everything that's, that goes on. Shane, don't ask about no shame either. <laughs> that's another thing. So this is what I'm saying. This is, I'm better to get to the perm when I get to it. Whenever the perm gets to it. The tea shall roll accordingly, baby. Let, I'm the MC. Let me MC. Bitch. <laughs> Let me roll it. That's how I do this. I'm tired of y'all telling me how to MC. I know how to MC. I've been doing this so long and y'all been alive. Happy on the pampas. So, so I'm going to get to the perm. So listen. So this is the perm. So Dean Bell. <laughs> ain't the perm. But it's only, so I'm like, okay, cool. So I say, well, check, look at that. I do, I do mess on Mondays only now. Because of uh, it's just too much. Every day was just too much on my life. It was just too much. So I do mess on Monday. So I said, "Well, I'm gonna give her a Monday, and that's gonna be her Monday next Monday." Don't trip. I got you, D Bell, baby. I said that on Sunday by Wednesday night, my page was zapped, gone, deleted. Well, I said, "Oh my God, why on earth would my page be gone? Like I didn't even do nobody nothing. I mean, D the fat, but other than that." Bitch, I ain't do nobody now. I ain't pay with nobody like that. Like, why would somebody to adapt my page? But I'm thinking about it. Oh, I threatened to drop a few pieces of tea on somebody. So then I say, okay, that's where it came from. That's where I came from. That's what happened. That's what had did it. That's what had did it. Oh, okay, okay. All right, all right, all right. So listen, everybody around me was telling me, oh, shake it. You got to pull back. You got to chill out because they're going to keep getting your page deleted. And I was like, well, fuck Instagram. Fuck the page. Fuck everything else. Y'all make sure y'all follow my backup page because I don't know what's going to happen after this. If I zap it again. But fuck all that. Backup page, I am MC Shake It Live. Another backup page is MC Shake It Live 2.0. I got three just in case we never know what's going to happen. But I was like, fuck Instagram. Because you got my page zapped, that don't mean I'm going to turn down. That means I'm going to turn the fuck up. That's what that mean. That don't mean shake and chill out. That means shake and burn up. You heard me? And so that's when I decided, okay, let me just start dropping the tea because I don't know who did it. But I truly believe the person that did it have to have a little... Mm, I'm going to add you in a second. Stay right there. I have to have a little muscle because... Somebody with a little bit more muscle call and got that bitch turned back on. Shout out to the dude YN Pip at YN.FB. I appreciate you, brother. I really, really appreciate you. And so they get my page turned back on like that. And the Instagram is telling me, oh, it was a mistake. It was an accident. No, it was an accident. Somebody called. And so I'm going to be dropping a little piece of tea on them every week. So next messy Monday, you know who turn it is? Oh, Judy, girl, you know you got to get you up next, girl. Judy, sister, you up next. I read D.I. book from part A to part B to part C to D, E, F, and all of them. Levels. So next Monday, it's your turn. I don't know who did it. I don't care why they did it. I don't care about none of that. Y'all about to do it again because next week, it's your turn. I don't care. Get it deleted. I don't care. 
Instagram don't make me. I'm shaking in real life. Don't forget, I'm shaking in real life. You have bigger problems to worry about than MC Shaky's page. I assure you. But, girl, it's your turn next week. And tell whoever did it, feel the wrath. Don't forget, Saucy Santana, you coming to my birthday party November 30th. I'll see you there, sister. I don't know who did it. I don't know who did it. There's probably one girl I can't get to. But, girl, oh, yes, y'all want this? This is what y'all want. I'm the messy punk, and I'm all this stuff like that. Well, guess what? I'm going to be the messy punk. Next week is your turn, sister. You got next. I don't care. It is. If they don't kidnap you this week. Baby, one thing about it. <laughs> messy Mondays, the tea will roll accordingly. If I have to record it tonight, if I have to record it tonight and just have it play upon my... If y'all can't find me next Monday, I'm going to have my sister just come and play that bitch. Don't trip out who record it and send it to her. Bitch, one thing about it and two things for motherfucking show. Period. That's what's going to happen. Uh. Baby, we're doing everybody that I think has something to do with my page being deleted. The only person I found out that, that didn't have nothing to do with it is Frida. And I apologize to her this morning. I'm sorry. I apologize. I was over here talking about you. My dad, my page is the leader, girl. But it wasn't you. And I, I apologize. I'm nothing to do with I'm wrong. I'm wrong. Y'all sipping, sisters? Okay, so look. This is what I need to do. Okay. So, no. I don't save lives on Instagram. I do not save them on Instagram. I put them on YouTube. If you don't know what my YouTube is, that means you're a newcomer and you don't need to be known. But I put them on YouTube. So, I will save this and put this on... I will put this on YouTube as... Alive. That's number one. Number two. You heard me. I'm about to show y'all the video. Pre-recorded and give it to me. <laughs> so, and, and, girl, and listen, and I'm not going to tell, listen, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Let me say something. I don't care about BB Judy, ins her insurance fraud. I committed more insurance fraud than that girl. Even, that's, she's smart. I would have helped her. Baby, I would have burnt the, bitch, I would have burnt, <laughs> I would have burnt the motherfucker down with her. Girl for my cut. That ain't nothing to me. I I like that. I applaud that. I'm a fraud. I went to jail nine years for fraud. You think I ain't did a little piece of insurance fraud in there? Bitch, like I said before, bitch. Who? I don't want, I'm sick of playing this fucking car note. Anybody want to do bitch, y'all wanna y'all wanna catch a wreck? Right quick, bitch. My neck, my back hurt, bitch. Period. I'm not worried about no that's not nothing. I'm talking about some tea. I don't do no tea. I, I, when I do tea, it's hot. And they have receipts. That insurance fraud, that's nothing. That's dumb. Y'all can stop talking about her with that. She did the right fucking thing. The white people have been doing it a thousand years. You think Bob and them, when their business start failing, they don't burn that bitch to the ground? Fuck no. Insurance fraud ain't nothing. Bitch, burn it down, sister. Get your money and build your bank. That was smart. I fucked with you for that one. That's big problem. That's big That's big ups to you for that. That's big up. There you go right there. YNFB. Dude got my Instagram page back. So that's big ups to you for that. I fucked with you for that. Bitch, make your money, make your money, make your money. That ain't even nothing. That ain't what I'm talking about. When I say T, I'm talking about, I'm talking about that T. I'm talking about that T with them receipts. See this? Because you know I built my platform with two words, two phrases. No receipts, no T. And I always have them. One thing about it, two things. So I am that motherfucker. Uh, check me. Anyway. So. So, okay. This is what I wanted to say. So that's like you got to be careful. Like you got to know everybody knows, girl. Everybody knows, girl. Everybody knows, girl. Everybody knows, girl. Girl, I said myself on the show. Um, oh, it was the video. Y'all got me tripping. So listen, Jake from State Farm is live, girl. Fuck Jake, stick with Jake. So listen, okay, let me um, hold on. I got the A Dean, cause he X. He said, oh, well, I don't think Dean is. Is Dean still there? So look, I think the question is, girl, why is, what, what is this girl getting, so she, if she pregnant, if she was pregnant and she got paid that much for the abortion or whatever the case may be, why on earth, I was never able to find an independent resource, not why on that earth? because I don't know, I have no clue. I'm just saying I was not able to find that. <laughs> just because I wasn't able to find it, don't mean that it don't exist. I was oh, just saying, I was not able to find it. Oh, look at that. I was not able to find nothing that said, Dean needed to type, oh, I need to add Dean. This was done. And also, too, this was a time before the, 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 the million dollars came on a Black Friday sale. That would have been in November. 
Not saying she had millions before. I don't know. I know she caked up. I don't know. I just don't know what the extent of it. But this is what I'm understanding. See, listen. When you have a... It, it's like... Listen, this is what fucks me up so much about people and what they be thinking and perception. Because perception is a beast. You can say this. Check it out. What If you got a million followers, people are more inclined naturally to follow you to see what the fuck is going on. So if you have a million followers, people... Do, so listen. By her selling a million products on Black Friday, guess what that make us do? Talk about the product. Not just on Black Friday, but every day. So we want to talk about the product and see what the product is going on. It was a smart idea. Don't get it twisted. It's smart, but it's only smart if you have some type of like, if a bitch like me ain't finding out that you didn't sell that much. But guess what? Because she, because if we hear, oh, girl, she just sold a million products, that's going to make people look at it like, more oh, bitch, I'm going to buy a product. Because the, with the, they, all these people buy it. You, that's why people be buying followers and people be doing all this and stuff like that because they want to see that, oh, you want to. <laughs> I'm not going to the rest of our life. So. <laughs> Girl. Oh, thank you, Dizon. Thank you, Dizon. Thank you. Thank you so much. I know. I know. I'm the go. So what I'm going to do is I will post up, because the video is on, I think, no, I'm going to do this. I'm going to put that on YouTube, too. I will just add, the, when I do the YouTube, I'm going to just add both of the videos to it. You hear me? So it'll be like, um, oh, what am I say? I want, um, yeah, so like if I tell you, bitch, I stole a million shirts, everybody going to want <laughs> Shaking shirts and stuff. You heard me? Everybody going, oh, girl, me, bitch, who got it? So it was a smart thing to do. It's smart. It's really smart. That's not a dumb, that's a good idea. Bitch, I wish I would have thought. <laughs> so that's a, bitch, a million. So you got all these blogs and all these people talk about it. So they made more people say, oh, whatever, whatever it is. I'm just saying, I couldn't corroborate it from an independent source. I just couldn't. I was looking for it. I couldn't find it. That don't mean it don't exist. So understand that before y'all go send that to her and say that I said, oh, she ain't been selling me problems. She probably sold two million. I don't know. I don't know what the hell. So, my YouTube is youtube.com forward slash MC Shaky, or you can just type in MC Shaky. So, with that being said, what I'm going to do is on the YouTube, I'm going to post that video and the video of the girl when we were talking about it. I did take out the voice part because she refuses to be identified, and I have to respect that part. I never reveal my sources, and, and it, it, it troubles me because I did ask and beg the girl. Please, come on to the line. Please come and tell your side of the story. She has a very interesting story to tell. I don't have the receipts for her story, but if I ever get them, I will share them. If she ever wants to come, I will come. I talk to her. I wish she could. I would, you know, she has a very interesting story, and I don't have receipts for it, so I don't talk about it. I only talk about what I have receipts for. And, there's, and so, she, okay, I don't know. This, so, y'all, there was three things that was a question. Why I did it, and I told y'all why I did it. I did it because I felt that, Shit, I don't know who had a hand and get my page deleted, but I'm going to just blame it on everybody. That's number one. Number two, I was called out of my name, and my sexuality is not even a question. I'm a messy person, not just a messy punk. That's number two, by this, by this person. And number three, you heard me, I feel like she, uh, that I'm being accused of something that I didn't do. And so that's why I did it. Why the girl did it, when she talked to me the first time, she got paid, she told me she got paid, she told me. She got paid the first money, but she did not get paid the second. She does not. T she did not tell me when I talked to her last time or today about the third or the fourth money. I don't know, but so I don't. I really don't. So oh, there goes in. So I'm. A, I will be posting this video and the other video on my YouTube, and that's I see then. What's going on? Stop the motherfucking legendary MC in New Orleans. What's going on? I'm What's going? Boy. What's going on? Cause bitch, right or wrong, I'm beating the hole behind you. Them always know that. Them always know that. Them always know how crazy I am behind my hoes. My hoes is my hoes. I told you what the score was, bitch. I told you what she came home and did in nine years, bitch. She went did nine years and came back and conquered the game and ended up fucking with her in the game right now. Period. Right, right, right. I'm here for it. Right. Dean told you hoes day. What's going on? What's going on, sister? Girl, I just, you know, I just did it. I just did it. What you say, name? What you say? Thank you. The neighbors say period, bitch. Oh, I got period, to bitch. all the girls. Anywhere I oh, step period. my foot, bitch, they love the D. What did that happen? On oh, period. On oh, period. Oh, period. That part. Sister. 
Period. <laughs> I love you, honey. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, I just I was just I was just airing out the girls and telling them what, what they need to be worried about instead of worrying about what the punk's doing. And we punks, we're gonna talk about the girls, we're gonna talk about the fish, and we're gonna talk about the mess, and we're gonna talk about the key. See, and we're gonna keep key. We're not gonna stop doing it. Tell them guys to see your donation. They got 800 holes on here watching your motherfucking live show. Support. <laughs> you are being entertained. This is for entertainment purposes only. Support, bitch. <laughs> this is our support thing, honey. Support us. We trying to make it to the next level, bitch. Right. Yay. So I, I just okay. dropped. I... One more time. Thank you. That's it. Huh? Yep. Let's ride, girl. I got the, the videos on this phone and on the an Android you can't do like on the iPhone pull up the thing and it do well on this Android you can it's a no fit no nine. So I'ma have to post the video on the YouTube. I can't post it on here. I don't I don't know it's not letting me do it. You can send it to me too. I no not, not, not no problem. Not no problem. Huh? So listen. Dean. Right. Right. So <laughs> so listen. You know what's up, you know what's happening next week, right? What? I'm going into that girl Judy. I'm gonna go. I'm going into her, and I'm in it. I'm in it. I'm about to get. I'm gonna get into her tea girl. Let's get into her tea girl. We're gonna get into her tea girl. We're gonna get into her tea girl. Yes, I'm here for it. Okay. I'm here. You know I'm here. Okay, I'm gonna get into her tea girl. I'm gonna get into her tea girl. So, 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 I'm gonna go live. I'm gonna let you finish your show. I want you to come to my live when I go live tonight. Okay, I got you. I got you. Let you finish your show, bitch, and I'm, I'm, I'm going back into the comment section. Okay, thank you, sister. All right, my sheet. All right, man. So it's 7.53. I was on here at 7 something. So that means the live is supposed to end in about 10 minutes. My lovelies, my true slippers, my real certified slippers, I thank y'all so much for coming here. I made my page private because I don't want people to say, oh, he's doing this for views. No, I want to have the same amount of views that I normally have. I made my page private, and I promise you, I had over 100 and some requests for people that's trying to go. It was all on the lipstick alley. Oh, who friends were shaking so we could see the lives. No, you don't, sister. Nah, I'll add you. After I take that, after the video come out, then I'll add you. I had over a hundred and some requests to go live. I declined all of them. I got, I got sixty-nine more. No, you don't. You should have been following me, sister. But at the same time, I don't want to do this for no views. I want to have the same amount of views that I normally have. I'm not doing this for no views. I'm going to definitely not. I'm not. They, they're not going to be able to stay on Instagram. I don't want no followers for me. Y'all can go ahead with all that. Don't come now. You should have been came. You remember? I want to have the same people. Only that I normally would have. This is a little more than I on an average day would have, but at the same time, at least y'all been following me before today. So I made my page private. I don't want no views from this. I don't want nobody to come accept me. I, I decline all. I'm declining all of them. Check catch me another day when I when I make my page back on private. But I made my page private because I didn't want nobody to think, oh, he doing this for views. He doing this for clout. Let me say you one thing, sister. I'm an entertainer. I'm an MC. I'm gonna always have a job. That's the one thing about it. And two things are true. I might not make a million, and that's cool. I want to make a million. I ain't no lie. But at the same time, bitch, one thing about it, two things, I'm not going to do it for no views. Y'all pay attention to the views and numbers that come. That's your job. But at the same time, I don't do that. So I definitely made my page private. If you wasn't following me before, you wasn't going to see this one here. You wasn't going to see it live and in living color. You have to go catch, go catch it tomorrow or something when I put it on YouTube. That part. Right now, if you want to see it now, you have to be somebody that was here before. You're not going to do it now. I'm not doing this for no views. I'm not doing this for no I don't do nothing for the likes. I do it for the love. That's what it is. So it's before y'all even said, oh, he was doing this for views, cloud chasing. Y'all can say that. I'm an entertainer, so I'm cloud chasing. Call it that. So I'm going to tell y'all right now, I'm cloud chasing. I'm an entertainer. By nature, I'm an entertainer. And I feel like I'm very entertaining. I feel like I'm the best. I feel like I'm, I feel like I'm the most entertaining person in the world. Sips tea. And with that being said, I drop the mic and go. Another checkmate. I am the GOAT. Don't ever forget that. No receipts, no tea. And guess what? I love y'all.